Gotta give a shout out to my boys at Once Media. Once Media in the house. All right, so yeah, you're in my booth right now. This is the Suckadelic booth. I'm the Suck Lord, and we're shucking bootleg figures here today. And if you don't know what bootleg figures are, it's not really my job to explain that to you. I'm sure you, being investigative journalists, have exhaustively covered it to the benefit of your fans, so I don't have to say what's already been said a million times, right? Because I don't fucking feel like it, and I don't have the answer. If you really want to know what that is all about, ask this fucking guy. I'm just trying to sell my shit. Right now, we're, we're branching out into fucking fancy art shit with the uh, Madonna Nudes series. That's the exclusive for the convention. It's a 20-piece edition, trying to go for a sort of more photographic, non-verbal. Hey, you're fucking not paying attention. I saw your eyes look the other way. I didn't ask to do this, and it's been a big seller. It's got real flocking for the pubic hair and the armpits. It's innovative as fuck. And then we have, under here, the greatest toy ever made. Now, uh, there's a lot of people doing this kind of work in the world, and I've been highly critical of their work. And then um, I've decided that because I'm a kind person to, to hide the piece, because I don't want anybody else to feel embarrassed by their work, and I don't want people walking around the convention to, to feel stupid because they don't understand it. It's that brilliant. But you can't look at it. You have to turn that off, and then you can look at it, and then we can stop or whatever, but you can't see it because the same thing holds true for your viewers. I don't want to insult their intelligence by calling attention to how deficient it is by challenging them with this very important piece of artwork. So you got to be here to really know what it's about. And if you didn't make it, too bad for you. It is. All right. Is that okay? Was that too much? Tech down here at DesignerCon in Pasadena. We holding it down.
kind of show people the artwork going on right here. All types of stuff, prints, pins, luchador masks. We got socks, silk screen, rock posters, vinyl toys, resin, t-shirts, some San Jose Sharks jerseys, bro. What's that about? Oh, snap, Los Tiberones in the house, son. That's right, Bay Area. My name is Francisco Reyes Jr. Uh, my brand is never made and I'm here selling my limited edition silkscreen art prints. The collaboration with Shepard Ferry was like a year in the making. Uh, I work with him, I sit like like two feet away from him and uh, just like put the idea in his head. It was just like, a, hey, like maybe we should collab on something. And he was like, yeah, sure. And I kind of thought he was just like shutting me up, you know? So then I started to kind of put, put together some concepts and at first he'd be like, mm, that's not quite it, that's not quite it, that's not quite it, that's not quite it. And I finally hit him with like the, the concept for the collab, which was like uh, a commentary on Donald Trump's divisive rhetoric and hateful speech, you know, and, um, and he liked it. And uh, I did the first comp and then he went ahead and then re-illustrated it with some of his flavor in there. At first, uh, I, I had done, uh, what was it? Deceit and Disorder and Destruction and Denial. And then he added another two. So we made a pair, uh, four prints total. And then we messed with the colors and stuff. But that's how the collab came together. Oh, yeah. it was, it was, it's a dream I, come true. Yeah. I have a, a collaboration with the Big Clothing that comes out in February. It's an artist series, so it's a never made Obey t shirt line for men and women. Sick. Yeah, so. Alrighty. Here to hear first. There it is. Yeah. I'm DJ Cuber, this is Naomi. How you doing? <laughs> and we're here at Designer Con. What do you think about this convention so far? It's been awesome. Actually, what's been really great is this set. He was scratching live. Tripping, it was so incredible. I to see. But the. Um, but um, yeah, the art here is really cool. There's a lot of underground stuff and a lot of street art, lots of clothes, lots of plush toys. Um, it's been really great. It's my first convention in America, actually. So it's been pretty sweet. Oh, right on. Cool. I'm glad you came. Yeah. Thanks. <laughs> Coming out with a second album. We got a show in December in San Francisco. And uh, yeah, look out for that. Shots to a D Styles and Shortcut. Dr. Octagon album is finally coming out, the, the real part two. And uh, so look out for that. Shots to Cool Keith and uh, Dan the Automator. I love it. I think it's one of my favorite places to perform at just because of all this cool stuff. I and mean, it's like, it's just beautiful, you know, like spreading the art. You know, that's what people should be doing instead of hating on each other. But you already know that already. <laughs> it's not hating, guys. Yeah. It's love. Spread the love. There you go. There you go. Look, peace and love. Okay. Okay. Okay.
Persuay COD, the creator of Bunny Kitty and the author of the book Origins of Bunny Kitty. Bunny Kitty is a character that I developed over 17 years ago and told the story of her in the streets through my graffiti. Wrote a, wrote a book and it took me about 11 years to release uh, this book, The Origins of Bunny Kitty. I released it about a year ago with Ginkgo Press, collaboration with One X Run out of Detroit. And uh, we're here at the the decon for the first time and having a great experience. Good time. Yeah. Um, hey guys, my name is Reina, and this is my illustration series called Soul Fatale, where I take iconic sneakers and transform into these goddess like beautiful pinup art. This one over here is my signature Air Mag Girl, and we have a figurine made from it, illustration inspired from the shoe and this is a figurine inspired from the drawing, so it's a full circle. So hi, I'm Melissa Doss from Mad Effects. Uh, we are here in Pasadena at DesignerCon 2017. Uh, these are my little guys, my scruffle monsters, and these are the monsters that live under your bed and eat your socks. <laughs> so if you were ever wondering why you're missing a pair or a couple or holes in your socks, it's these guys. Um, and these are my fun plushies that I make. They have glow-in-the-dark teeth, uh, this one's got fun metallic teeth, and this is what I do when I'm not being a creature creator and monster builder. <laughs>
since that's pretty much my own thing. Um, one of my favorite things that I'm selling right now is uh, this new book that I have called Bunny With. And it's just uh, basically a different, a bunch of bunnies with something else. Seems kind of demented, but fun. So yeah, I don't know. I just make a bunch of stuff. So you should come check it out. Hey yo, check one, two, flavor, flavor, and the place to be from the bottom to the T.O.P. You know what I'm saying? Decon.